Think of something you're afraid of. Go ahead, take your time. But I've got something scarier. Something that causes thousands of deaths a year. Something that costs us billions of dollars a year in the US alone to combat. And something that is certainly in this room. Bacteria inhabit every crack and crevice in our body. And a few of them might be harboring something very dangerous. These are the superbugs. Oh my god, a superbug? Superbugs are bacteria that are resistant to our antibiotics. Today, the development of antibiotic resistance threatens to throw us back to a time where the top three killers of humans were all bacterial infections. Hold up, what even are antibiotics really? Antibiotics are drugs that are used to stop the growth of or outright kill bacteria, which cause diseases like pneumonia or cholera, but not things like the flu. Antibiotics are drugs that are either synthesized by human beings or derived from natural samples. They work by recognizing parts of the bacteria like the cell wall or other portions of the cell that make proteins that the bacteria need to survive. Behind every story of antibiotic resistance is a mutation. In fact, superbugs are just mutants. These mutations either alter or form new genes that give the superbugs their superpowers. There are three different superpowers that we know of. One involves pumping the antibiotic out of the cell before it can do its job. The bacteria creates pumps in its cell wall and uses the energy from ATP to push it out. Superpower number two, invisibility. The superbug changes the target, even if slightly so the antibiotic can no longer recognize it and again blocks it from doing its job. The third is to straight up destroy the antibiotic. Breaking it down to the other compounds that are just not effective at fighting bacteria. Now if I've done my job, you're terrified of superbugs at this point. You're probably thinking, okay, but what do I do about it? How do I protect myself? You can lock yourself in a bubble. Otherwise, not much. And we don't really know the answer yet. What we do know to do is always wash your hands, and take your antibiotics exactly as your doctor prescribes them. There are some promising new therapies on the horizon though, like combinatorial drug treatments. Let's just hope they arrive before the next superbug does. If you're interested in finding out more, here's where you can do it.